but it's no longer really an opportunity or choice, it's an imperative. And to telling the story, how do we make sure that um, you know we're taking full advantage of any and all assets that are on the, the grid and at customer premises. Each episode, we delve into the world of energy, aiming to bridge the gap of understanding and challenge conventional thinking. Welcome, everyone. Let's get started. Welcome to the McKinney Microgrid. My name is Sandy Coughlin. I'm the Director of Marketing here at InExchange, and I'm joined with our CEO, David Swink. Welcome, David. What do you think about this view? Well, it's great to be in downtown McKinney here, uh, Sandy, and you know, it's, it really makes a perfect place to launch our first podcast. Uh, actually, where we're standing is at our facilities, our headquarters in downtown McKinney. And as you can see, our audience can see, uh, we're standing on the rooftop of one of four facilities here on the campus. And they can see the solar, uh, beyond solar here, we actually have a utility yard where we have battery storage and we have natural gas generation. Uh, I don't think they can see here through this perhaps camera shot, but we have weather stations, uh, all the buildings, the HVAC is all intelligent devices. And what's really, I think, worthy of, of noting is all built, designed, engineered by the NX team. It says a lot about, I think, the NX team and uh, what they offer to our clients that they're able to not only engineer, design, but actually install a microgrid that they're seeing here today. Awesome. And just so you know, our audience is getting a behind the scenes look. This is not a normal stop on our tour, so pretty exciting. And you're getting also a little feel for what resilience means to our team. So David, let's talk about the EI360 podcast and what EI360 means. Well, the EI meaning energy intelligence and the 360 being that idea of having a 360 degree view, we call it generation to toaster. You know, what if you could see all of your assets in one system? And when we think about energy intelligence, I think today it is so important uh, that we become more intelligent about energy. And one of the things we're going to try to unpack in this podcast is really to enable our audience to hear more about, you know, the various technologies, uh, the various innovations, and how those are changing the energy landscape. We're going to talk about how we can empower people uh, to be not just consumers, but prosumers of energy. And then what we really hope to do is to engage a lot of industry experts as we go from week to week on this podcast. Excellent. So the energy industry is experiencing a lot of obstacles and challenges. What do you um, have to say about how we approach those challenges and how we can hopefully overcome those obstacles? You know, the two things that come to my mind, well, first of all, I think one of the quotes I've always appreciated is that um, the, the world as we've created it is the process of our thinking. And if we're gonna change things, we must change our thinking. That was actually said by Albert Einstein. And I think what really prevents us sometimes from thinking differently and seeing things differently is, you know, one, our paradigms, our, our set of rules, the way that things have always been. You know, how many times do we hear it in our organizations? Well, uh, we've always done it this way. Well, with new technologies and new innovations and the exponential growth of technology, we got to change the way that we see the world, the way that we see energy and how it's actually generated and how it's produced and how it's delivered to the client. Uh, and then also we need to realize that in our organizations we, we're going to have to raise the bar, if you will. Uh, one of the great books I read was called The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership and it talked about the law of the lid and how so many times we as individuals are the lid because of our awareness and because of our intelligence of energy. So I hope that every week in this podcast, um, you know, we really do force ourselves and to force those that are listening to think differently, uh, see things differently, and hopefully we'll deliver differently. Well, I know personally, my team here at An Exchange challenges me to think differently every day, and shout out to you guys. Uh, but also, we have amazing ecosystem partnerships. So, David, can you speak a little bit about what the ecosystem partnership looks like here at An Exchange? Well, I think one of the important things in life is how much we can learn from others and how we can glean uh, from others who have experiences and walk journeys we haven't, we haven't walked. And you know, one of the key elements of the uh, ecosystem or partners of NX is to, to really increase the value of not only our offering, but to increase the value because of the fact that we bring in people who are experts in their in their field. And so over the next several weeks, we'll be inviting 
uh, a number of those partners to be a part of this uh, podcast and allow them to share their insights, uh, their journey, their experiences, their vision of what they see the future market looking like. Absolutely. We're really excited to have our partnerships come in and, and have discussions with us. And we're so excited that you were able to join us today for our first episode. And that's it for this one. And we hope that you subscribe, engage, contribute, and let us know what you think. 